Hello, we will present uh, SpinLunch, a startup found in 2014 to reimagine space launch technology and enable the rapid and cost effective deployment of a small satellite constellation into low Earth orbit. Using its revolutionary kinetic launch system, the company conducts a successful vertical launch at its uh, spaceport New Mexico test site in October 2021. Headquartered run in Long Beach, in California, Spin Launch employs over 200 employees and is led by an executive team from top tech, engineering, and aerospace companies. It is backed by partners including Airbus Ventures, Google Ventures, and Kleiner Perkins. The company is on target to place satellites in orbit and deliver payloads for spacefaring endeavors by 225. The catapult, uh, sort of rotating disc, uh, 50 uh, meters in diameter and reaching uh, high, higher than the Statue of Liberty, sent a projectile 3 meters long at uh, as a speed of several thousand kilometers per hour, 1030 to 8000 kilometers per hour. Uh, speed sufficient to reach the suborbital uh, sub level, I assure Jonathan Yanni, the founder of Speed Launch. Uh, and again, the test was only carried out with 20% of the maximum speed of the device. The first objective of Speed Launch is to complete with space rockets to send small satellites into space. Today, the mass of a launcher is essentially made up of fuel, which consequently reduces the mass and uh, the space available uh, for the real payload. This project should lead to, to an ecological uh, step. In fact, uh, spin launches system requires less hydrogen and oxygen uh, and could send small satellites weighing up to 180 kilograms. Uh, the catapult will thus use for four times less fuel uh, and reduced launch cost by 10. For the business model, uh, what will be the product and or uh, the service offering? Uh, it's offering sale of an innovating product in the aerospace market. Um, <clears throat> what are the traits uh, of the proposed offer? Its advantages? What makes it different from the competition? This offer um, is the only one on this uh, market. So it has ecological, economic, and uh, time advantages by uh, less fuel, less price invested in a launch project, and uh, less uh, design time in the creation of the projectile. Uh, who is this offer intended for? The project seeks to, to target uh, companies such as NASA, Blue Origin, or uh, SpaceX. How will uh, the offer be offered uh, to the target clientele and uh, what is the strategy? Um, presentation and test carried uh, out are the only means of communication on the project. Uh, for instance, uh, with this video. What are the means necessary for the implementation of the offer? Uh, the construction of infrastructure allowing projectiles to be put into orbit. Uh, therefore, the startup requires a substantial advancement fund. Okay, and uh, what is the expected financial cost? For give us an idea, uh, the price of the launch is uh, valued at $500,000 according to Jonathan Yanni.
we can wonder about this issue. Yes, but uh, the space race, the space race is not uh, its only possible outlet. The Pentagon is also very interested in the startup to to launch military mini satellites and uh, missiles. It is not uh, it is not coincidence that the startup signed a, a contract with the Pentagon's innovation department in 2019. Thanks for for the addition.